We are celebrating remarkable women here at WCIA3, even ahead of our month-long special coming up in March. So this weekend, the Virginia Theater in Champaign is showcasing girl power as part of the That's What She Said show. So joining me now, the director, Jeanette, and one of the speakers, Ariel. So let's go through an overview. What is That's What She Said? Well, that's what she said is like the ultimate girls night out, yes. I think. It started here in Champaign 10 years ago. Um, three amazing women just came up with the concept of creating a safe space for women to come together, support each other by sharing personal intimate stories. And now 11 years later, this is our ninth show in Champaign, and it's uh, real women from our community who have been um, working for the last three months developing a story from their life's experience that they're gonna share live on stage, being bold and brave and vulnerable it's a pretty powerful night so Ariel you're gonna be one of those people sharing your story why was it important to you to speak out it's important to um, share my story because I live through a lot and I am very passionate about encouraging women that they can overcome and make it through whatever life throws at them how does it make you feel are you nervous <clears throat> to step on the stage or are you ready to help other women take those steps they need well I have a little nerves <laughs> you know but Jeanette gives us wonderful exercises so that we feel confident and ready but I'm I'm very ready to share my story I have my people's in the audience so I'm looking forward to their support and their presence with me as I do that. So Jeanette what are some of the stories that women can maybe expect Back, can you give maybe just a little bit of an example? I can give you a little teaser. We sure. don't want to give it all away. 100%. But, um, I mean, we have we had rehearsal last night, and oh my gosh, these women are ready. We have a mother-daughter duo um, talking about some very unique things that they have in common um, through their life experience. Um, we have another mother talking about her um, journey to become a mother um, and the challenges she faced. We have some very funny moments, too. Yes. Uh, one woman <laughs> something very awkward and unusual that happened to her on a, on a trip overseas. So we love to uh, like surprise the audience a little bit because we encourage these women to talk about things that maybe they aren't already known for, maybe something they haven't shared with their closest friends before. We're, uh, we're, we're getting a little peek behind the scenes of their life. At the end of the day, what would you say the goal is? The goal is to inspire and empower the women of our community because there's something really powerful about seeing a woman standing on stage, sharing something that is not comfortable, not something you know you hear every day. And, and we like to think of it like a window or a mirror. Like you can either look in a mirror and be like, oh my God, me too, I know what that feels like. I'm not alone. Or you're looking through a window and learning something new about something a woman lived through and it gives you more insight and power to make choices in your own life. So let's quickly walk through some of those logistics, who, what, where, when, why, how people get tickets. Excellent, I bring my cheat sheet. So that's what she said. This is our ninth show in Champaign-Urbana. It's presented by Sterling Wealth Management. We're very grateful for their assistance. It will be Saturday night, February 24th at 7 p.m. on stage at the Virginia Theater, our historic, gorgeous, renovated downtown theater. Um, tickets are available at their box office or at thevirginia.org. And t this year's show features these amazing women. So Myla Thomas-Fuller, Izzy Gonzalez, Jane Green, Emily Harrington, Danielle Hendricks, Nicole Morgan, Ariel Sadler, Jennifer Shelby, and So Yun Song. Um, we also like to share that a percentage of our ticket sales always go to benefit a local nonprofit agency. This year we're supporting races and the work that they do to prevent um, sexual violence and support survivors of sexual violence. And then there's also an after party. So yes. like, the, whole, the night continues. So after the show, there are tickets available also for the after party hosted by the Junior League of Champaign-Urbana, sponsored by Commerce Bank, and it will be at the gorgeous venue of Neal Street Blues. And so tickets are also available on the Virginia's website for that as well. So, I mean, we're just really excited. And yes. something new this year, um, um, we make inclusivity and accessibility a priority at the She Said Project, and so we're always looking for ways that we can advance that mission. And this year, we've made the decision to have an ASL interpreter on stage during the show, interpreting the stories in real time. So we're really excited to make the show accessible for all. Looking forward to it. All about girl power. Yes. Thank you so much for joining us Thank this you. morning. You can find this interview along with others on our website, WCIA.com.